Australian Navy guided missile frigate HMAS Parramatta FFH 154 left along with the US. Navy amphibious assault ship USS America LHA-6 the Ticonderoga class guided missile cruiser USS Bunker Hill CG-52 and the early Burke class guided missile destroyer USS Barry DDG-52 for operations in the South China Sea starting April 13. HMAS Parramatta FFG-154 began sailing with Ticonderoga class guided missile cruiser USS Bunker Hill CG-52, then rendezvoused with amphibious assault ship USS America LHA-6 and early Burke class guided missile destroyer USS Barry DDG-52 April 18. Their combined operations started with force integration training and maneuvering exercises between Parramatta and Bunker Hill. Operations with USS America started with a precision maneuver that included Barry in the South China Sea. Operations with Parramatta have included integrated live fire exercises, coordinated helicopter operations, small boat force protection drills, command and control integration, and maneuvering interoperability. The events gave both navies the opportunity to integrate all warfare areas and further strengthen the bond between both countries. The US and Australia share a long history of integrated military exercises. Over 3,000 US sailors and Marines had the opportunity to observe or participate in the combined exercise. US 7th Fleet conducts forward deployed naval operations in support of US national interests in the Indo-Pacific area of operations. As the US Navy's largest numbered fleet, 7th Fleet interacts with 35 other maritime nations to build partnerships that foster maritime security, promote stability, and prevent conflict.